you have to think and you have to answer to this question right an object starting from rest question number 9 amma an object starting from rest travels 20 meters in first 2 seconds and and 160 meters in next 4 seconds okay what will be the velocity what will be the velocity after 7 seconds very very important 7 seconds from the start okay from the start that is what from the start means body is starting from zero so what is the initial velocity anybody yes 0 meter per second 0 meter per second that is what you have to remember okay so this is what the question so let me take now first i am taking uh, observe very carefully an object is from starting from sir yeah sir, from the first from the first they are asking sir Hmm. so that we can uh, add it those two no sir it's two also from first no sir sorry be very careful first thing if you want to find the velocity after 7 seconds means first you have to verify first this 20 meters journey and this next 160 meters journey either their acceleration is same or not understand mari if the acceleration is same only then only you can find the final velocity yes or no constant acceleration you remember yes sir yeah that is our main thing now so first let me draw first all of you observe very carefully so i am taking now first journey just i will mention the total time so first we have to find the final velocity after how many seconds guys final velocity after how many seconds all of second you. after 2 seconds ah after 7 seconds. seconds ah after 7 seconds we have to find the time so now 0 seconds after that 1 second after that 2 seconds 3 seconds 4 seconds 5 seconds 6 seconds and 7 seconds is it okay till here anybody having any doubt you can ask clear guys all of you so first 2 seconds it travel how much distance all of you first 2 second it is travel a journey of how much respond guys 20 meters 20 20 meters meter. okay. so the first 2 seconds it travels a distance of how much ra kishor 20 20 meters sir let me take that point is a and this point is b now next 4 seconds first 2 seconds to uh, 20 meters next 4 seconds next 4 seconds means till what what time till 4th second or 6th second next 4 2 plus 4 how much 2 plus 4 how much rat there ra 6 next 4 it has been traveled with a velocity of oh, sorry distance of how much guys how much it has traveled 160 meters. 160 160 okay that is the point c till here it reached now they are asking by the time of 7th second what is its velocity that is what is asking final velocity yes or no guys if the body is starting from rest we all knows that initial velocity is what initial velocity is what zero zero okay so now you can see here let me find first velocity at point b forget about this final velocity i know that point a it is started first see only this case alone all of you so uh, let me find what is the velocity of b uh, by reaching to the time 2 uh, seconds what is the velocity of the object let me find it now so we all know imagine only this case and tell me how to find which equation what is the given data you know all of you for the motion from a to b for the motion from a to b what is the initial velocity everybody we all knows initial velocity zero what zero very good 
Yes, is equals to how much it is? Twenty meters. And the time is time is equals to how many seconds? Zero to two. Two seconds. Clara. Yes, please respond, guys. Yes, yes sir. sir. So let us find what is the acceleration from A to B. So which equation you can use, everybody? I want sir, to find. Sir, first equation we need to find the velocity uh -huh. only. Mari, we can find velocity also. Of course, you can use first equation. So velocity at point B, velocity at point B. So which is equals to which equation, guys? First equation. V equals to u plus a t. So if we apply, what we know initial velocity is zero plus acceleration is we don't know into time. So that is why first you have to find acceleration. Yes or no, Mari? Yes, sir. If you want to find the final velocity, you need to know what? Acceleration. 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 Clear, everybody? So if you want to find the final velocity, you need to know something. What do you have to do, everybody? We need to find the... Please respond. Acceleration. 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 Start our acceleration. So from, from this given data, I want to find acceleration. Can you tell me which equation I can use? Ut plus half at. Half at. Okay, so that is what it is. Next, so S is equal to how much? 20. Initial velocity is 0. So everything is 0 plus half into A into what is the time? 2, two seconds. Two second. yeah, which is equal to so 20 into this is half into A into 4. So 2 1s are 2 2s two are. So acceleration is equal to how much, guys? Okay, of course, 2A is equal to 20. From that, a is equals to 20 by 20 by 2. How much am I acceleration? All of 10 you. meter per second square. 10 meter per, 10 meter per second square. This is from where? From a to what is the acceleration from a to b? Everybody. 10 meter per second square. 10 meter per second square. So substitute in this, we'll get it. So v is equals to 0 plus a. A value, how much am I? All of you. A value, how much we got? Everybody, 10, 10 into 2. So, 10. what is the velocity at point B? What is the velocity? Everybody, 20 meter per second. 20 meter per second. Is it okay, Agalia? So, velocity at B, velocity at B, which equals to 20 meter per second. Is it okay, guys? Everybody, please respond, guys. All of you? Yes, sir. Yes, yes sir. Now, Again, at the point B, either he is coming to rest or continuing with the same velocity. Anybody? Continuing, continuing with the same velocity. Means, the final velocity of the B is equals to initial velocity of this point. Is it yes or no, Mari? Will you accept it? Everybody? Be sure? I am taking yes, from. Everybody yes, will sir. accept it or not? The final velocity of the point B is equals to initial velocity of the next journey. Is it okay, guys? Please respond. Yes, sir. So that is what I will take it. So from B to C, let me calculate for the motion. For the motion from B to C. So what is the already uh, what is the already velocity of a B? Uh, what is the velocity of a body at B point? Everybody, yes, please. Twenty meter per second. Meter per second. So that is initial velocity. Yeah. Final velocity. Yeah. Initial velocity. Initial yeah. velocity. A to B, it is the final velocity. From B to C, it is what velocity? Everybody, B to initial C velocity. velocity, initial velocity, clear everybody, that is what, now, what is the distance from B to C, what is the distance, 160 meter, 160 meter, and time is equals to, check it, 6, six minus, seconds. Two. Uh, 6 seconds are 6 minus 2, uh. yes sir, 4 seconds, uh, 6 four minus seconds. 2 seconds, which is equal to how many seconds, everybody, 4 seconds, 4, four seconds, clear, yeah? so let us find the acceleration, Everybody. So what is the acceleration? We'll find it later. Velocity we can find at point C. Okay. So let us make it everybody. So what is that? Everybody respond. S is equals to first U T plus half A T square. Let us verify. So S is equals to that means. So what is the S is equals to 160. Initial velocity how much? 0 or 20? Yeah? 20. 20. Into 4 plus half into acceleration into time is equals to 4 square. So 160 is equals to 24 is so how much am I? 80. 80. Okay. Plus here 4 square. 4 square means how much? 
16. 16 by 2 into A. Okay, everybody, Pranav, understand Pranav? So, 2 ones are 2 eights. So, 160 is equals to 80 plus 80A. Now, I will take 80A is equals to 160 minus 80. So, 160 minus 80 means how much, guys? 160 minus 80, 80. So, 80A is equals to 80. So, 80 is equals to 80 divided by A. So, what is the acceleration again? What is the acceleration? 10 meter per second square. 10 meter per second square. 10 meter per second square. Can you tell me? From A to B is also acceleration is 10 meter per second square. Means B to A is also acceleration is 10 meter per second square. Means constant. Acceleration is constant for the motion from A to what? A to C, acceleration C. is constant. So, from B to C is also acceleration is constant. So, if acceleration is constant, can I find the velocity after 7 seconds? Yes or no? Everybody? I found it. I found it what? Acceleration from A to C. Is it constant or varies? Constant, sir. It's constant. constant. Acceleration constant. is constant. Understanding. For the motion, from where to where? Motion from a to B and B to C means in the sense of A to B and B to C means total journey is what? A to A to A to C. So means C. In the sense of velocity after then velocity after seven seconds from where they are asking from the start. Yes or no, guys? From the start. From the start means what? From the A point or uh, B point or C point? Which point? From the start. From C the point. Start, uh, C uh. From the start. A point. A point. From the start is, means from A point. From A. Okay. From A point. From A point means what is the initial velocity? Everybody, we know that. Zero. We Zero meter. Acceleration is constant. What is the acceleration? Agalia? 10 meter per second. Meter per meter now, per after second how many square. seconds we have to find the velocity? Final seven velocity. Seven seconds. Seven seconds. Seven, seven seconds. Equation we can use. U plus. First equation. Yeah. So final velocity is equal to initial velocity zero. Acceleration is constant. Time is equals to seven. So V is equal to how much, guys? 70. 70 meter per second. Clear? Huh? Everybody. Understood or asked? Yes, Mari, yes, please. Yes, sir. Yeah, even theoretically, also we can say this one. Can you find velocity at C? Velocity at C, let me find it just for our purpose. Final velocity at C, which is equals to, you can find it by using first equation. V is equals to U plus AT. From B to C, check it, everybody. So, what is the initial velocity of a B? At point B, what is the initial velocity? 20 plus 10. acceleration is 10. And time is 4, which is equal to verify. 20 plus 40. 10 fours of 40, which is equal to how much, guys? Velocity at C. Velocity at C means how much, Ramari? 60, then we need to add the 10 uh, at the first. I noticed it. No, not 10. Every time. So, 6 seconds, 60 meter per second. Means 1 second, what is the velocity? 10 meter per second. 2 seconds, 20 meter per second. 3 seconds, how much? 30 meter per second. 4 seconds, how much? 40 meter per second, 5 seconds, 50 meter per second, 6 seconds, 60 meter per second. Then, and then 70, 7 seconds means how much it will come? 70 meter per second. Clear? But it's not theoretically, you cannot say. Practically, we have to prove. So, we have proved or not? Sir, mostly they will give in a uh, uniform rate only, no, sir? Maximum 100% they will give in uniform rate. But that is why you should find the acceleration. You all understand? Everybody? Yes. If you want to know the velocity after a certain time, you need to know either the body is in uniform acceleration or not. Do you all understand everybody? That is the yes. best way to find it. Unless so so that the initial stage itself we can take as a... You uh, cannot take body. That is what you have to prove it, correct? How you know acceleration is constant? Are you clear? Yes, sir. If it is freely falling, suppose if it is falling like this or it is thrown like this vertically, again as to gravity. So then I can take G value is constant. But if it is moving horizontally, I don't know, correct, what is acceleration? Understood? Yes, sir. So you have to first find what is acceleration. Either acceleration is constant or variable, or you have to know it. Clear, everybody? So unless you know the acceleration, is it possible to find the final velocity? Any formula you can use. Is it possible to find the velocity without knowing the acceleration? That is what my question. Okay. No. 
Are you clear, everybody? All of you? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So that is what you have to remember. Any doubt anybody having, you can ask me. So this is very, very important. Okay. Have you understand everyone? Shivani? Yes, Kira, Shivani? Yes, sir. Yeah. But if it is working against to gravity, then I can take. Acceleration is constant. Because what? Always rate of acceleration is same. How much it is? G value is always constant. 10 meter per second square. Going down or coming up. But only negative or positive. Alone. Going up, negative. Coming down, positive. Okay, everybody? Nivedan? Yes, sir. Yeah. So that is yes, sir. So question number 10, homework question. Right. An electron moving with a velocity of an electron, an electron moving with a velocity of 5 into 10 power 4 meter per second. Second enters into a uniform electric field uniform electric field and acquires acquires a uniform acceleration of acquires a uniform acceleration of 10 power 4 meter per second square. 10 power 4 means how much? 10,000. Yes or no? 10 power meter per second square in the direction of direction of its initial motion. Direction of its initial motion. Means in the sense of it is moving like this so that it acquires the acceleration at this point and it will become acceleration increases how many times guys 10 power 4 meter per second square do you understand uh? yes please acceleration is equal to 10 power 4 meter yeah. per second so square. what is the initial velocity what is the initial velocity initial velocity is equals to 5 into 10 power 4 meter per second do you all understand everybody please respond yes sir. Now, suddenly it will enter into a uniform electric field. This is electric field. So, electric field. So, before entering into the electric field, what is the velocity of it? Initial velocity, 5 into 10 power 4 meter per second. Now, after entering into electric field, its acceleration increases how much? Everybody? 10 power 4, 10 power 4 meter, meter per second. Per. And it is moving in the same direction. Now, they are asking initial direction. Fine. Calculate. Roman number one, calculate the time in which, time in which the electron would acquire, would acquire, acquire a velocity double of its initial velocity, acquire a velocity Double. Double means what, guys? What is the initial velocity? Anybody? Kishore? What is the initial velocity? Double velocity. What is the initial velocity, guys? Double. Ah, 5 into 10 power 4 meter per second. Now it's saying double. So double means what? 2 times of u. 2 times of u means how much? Ra? Anybody can tell me? Two times of you. So initial velocity is zero ah, now. See, five into ah, zero. Ah, five into so ten, five into 10 power four now, sir. Ah, then we need to double. multiply with the two. It's double seven. means so, which is how much? Ten into ten power four meter per second. So to acquire this velocity, what is the time taken? You have to calculate it. That is the first thing. Next, second thing, how much distance? Be, be, be very careful without any help you have to solve it how much distance the electron would cover in this time so during the time what is the distance covered by it you have to calculate it so very simple by using first equation by using second equation you people will obtain this first and roman number one and roman number two so I'm giving you already everything. We know the acceleration. We know the initial velocity. 
one we want to make the velocity double velocity double means already i have given you the clue here final the velocity is 10 into 10 power 4 meter per second so that is only final velocity yes or no everybody kishore understood it's become a double to acquire the velocity double so it is a final velocity so 10 into 10 power 4 means how i can write in the form of powers can you tell me can i write as a 10 power 5 meter per second yes or no yes please Yes, sir. Love you. So that is what my final velocity. So you cannot find the time. You know the initial velocity, you know the final velocity, and you know the acceleration. Can you you can find the time or not? You cannot find out. Sir, we can find, sir, but uh, first formula is uh, V is equal to U, U plus A T. Oh, yes, Mari. Initial velocity is 10, 5 into 10 power 4. Final velocity is 10 power 5. You cannot find the time. Uh, and acceleration yes, is 10 sir, power but 4. we don't know the velocity, no, sir. What velocity, Mare? V. V only we found. I, I given correct. It acquires a velocity double of its initial velocity. It acquires a velocity double. Means in the sense of, for example, you are starting initially at 5 meter per second. You acquire say double velocity, two times of initial velocity. That is your final velocity. Are you clear? Yes, sir. Uh, then what will happen? That is only I am asking the question now. Your initial velocity is 5 into 10 power 4. Now you acquire after certain time t, you acquire the final velocity, which is two times of initial velocity. Then you cannot find the acceleration is equal to 10 power 4 meter per second square. Can you, you cannot find time? Yes, sir. Yeah, that's all. Solve this and send me. Everybody. Okay. So that is what I yes. Thank you.